Turner is a clown. He is a goofy kid. Uh, he's always, you know, he's caring about everybody. He makes sure everybody's like feeling good and in a good mood. And he's always the one that's just hyperactive and, you know, making everybody smile and laugh. And uh, kid can shoot the ball like nobody else can, really. Again, it's good. He's always, he knows, he knows he has a great jump shot. So he always tries to put a competition in there because he's real confident. Let's play for the kid. Ah, oh, let's go. Don't, don't talk to me. I already beat you. No, you just gave me just time. No. You rebound. Get a rebound for me. See, now you changed the but uh, it's always fun just mess around with Spencer because he does make you laugh some way. If he doesn't do it one way, then he's going to try something else to make you smile or laugh. So, you know, whenever you're in a bad mood, if you just hang around him for a little bit, he'll get you smiling. So. That's what happened. You shoved 40 into Coach Byers and he hit it with the I swear I did. That's what he said. No, I really I, pr I, I didn't touch him. He, he, he pushed, pushed, him. He pushed oh, me the and door. Back. Yeah, he yeah. pushed him and I grabbed him. It's obvious. Like, yeah, he's, he's, like, like, he's like, get yeah. on. It's yeah. obvious what Spencer did in the game. But, yeah. Yeah. I, I promise I did not do one thing to him. <laughs> <laughs> Spencer's too like. Spencer I, I was running. Oh, yeah. Spencer, Spencer was more running. He was like, yeah, I was taking it off. I was running. I was scared. And D, my main man here, got me. Got me. D, my main man. And then Coach Byer got me. Hold on. Coach Byers, hey, 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 come here, come here, punk. Get out of me. Get out of me, punk. You hit me first, I swear. And then Jazz, come on, bro. I got this, I got this, coach. I got this, coach. I got this, coach. Alex, who's talking? You, probably. Oh, yeah. Get him. Get him. Oh, probably you, yeah. You're right here, then. He's probably the goofiest kid I know. Um, a lot of people say I'm goofy, but. Uh, athletically, but in terms of Spencer's attitude, he's probably the goofiest kid I know. Oh my God! Uh, Spencer can shoot the lights out. Um, Spencer, ever since I was little, Spencer would always play up in AAU, and he would um, he'd always beat my team. I think I beat him once, and that was like in the ninth grade. So from fifth to ninth grade. He'd always beat me. Spencer is one of those kids who's always been a great, great shooter. And, and uh, through his junior high and his AAU stuff, you know, he played for his dad in, in the AAUs, and he always got to shoot a lot, and he hit a lot. And he was uh, always a, a shooter. And he came in as a freshman, and I remember his freshman year, the first game, I put him on the JV. And he said, I could have been practicing with the varsity all the time. I said, well, you just need to play a quarter to this first game here to get the jitters out. Well, I don't have any jitters, you know. Well, he was horrible in the JV game. I'd come in the game as a freshman, and I'd be, I'd, I'd be scared. You know, I, I'd be nervous. I'd be like, oh, my gosh, I'm a freshman. My, my first couple of games playing in front of 3,000 people. Um, you know, it was, it, I mean, it, it's scary for any kid to go through that. Came back in, we played him in the varsity that same night, and he hits like five threes in a row. And uh, after the game, he said, thanks, I, I, I I guess I didn't know what I really needed, you know. And uh, He just has to learn what he can do and what he can't do. And uh, he works at it. And he's, uh, he's always joking, always wanting to shoot for Cokes. And, and he's also one of those guys that sort of pumped up. Like, he's, you know, Kyle Fletcher and him and Nate Peck. And even, you know, D gets started. And, you know, they all get jiving around and talking. But... Let's go! Biggest thing is uh, me and betting. I mean, it's just, it's, it's not a, it's not a bad kind of bet like gambling and stuff like that. It's just joking around betting. Um, you know, a lot of the guys do just to joke around. But you know, if, a, if, if I'm out there shooting, I'll, I'll go over to half court and I'll I'll say, hey, Coach Seifers or hey, Coach Simpson or hey, Coach Byers or something like that. Uh, I'll say, I'll, I'll bet you a dollar for this shot, um, and I, and I'll just throw it up or something. But I mean, just I mean, you, you gotta have a good time. I mean, you only live once. Um, you only go through it once. Um, I've heard I've heard way too many times from my parents um, and from from older people that you know cherish this time, cherish these moments, because I mean in a blink of an eye it's all going to be gone. So I mean I, I don't I don't want to look back and think, oh man those practices were so bad, you know they're so long and dreadful. Um, so you know I, I just want to you know, go out and have fun, and you know all my teammates are wanting to have fun out there. We're all cutting up and laughing and smiling and everything. 
Um, but once once you're on the court, though, I mean, once you cross those those uh, sidelines, then you get you get on the court. I mean, it's all serious business. It's all you know, serious time. No more no more smiling. No more joking around. Stuff like that. Anything else, coaches? Players have a question. Anyone? Let's go off a good start here now. Third quarter. Let's get this game under control. Let's go. 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 Two hours, um, you know. He, he was, he, he's my best friend. I mean, he really is, I and mean, he re, he rebounds for me. You know, he he does all these great things for me um, just to make me better. I mean, he, he knows my shot even better than I do. Most kids, some kids don't have a father like that that are that is going to be there for you, um, and that's you know that's as loving and caring as him. Uh, so you know, I definitely, I definitely am grateful for that. Uh, I, I, I'm not going to take that for granted or anything. Right here. Get a little pressure on him. Get a little pressure. 